A frightening scene and future is on tap for commuters trying to get through Philadelphia. A recently rebuilt portion of I-95 collapsed this morning because of a tanker fire. Fox's CB Cotton has the latest. Monday morning's commute will come with new headaches for some drivers in the Northeast as people are told to stay away from an interstate collapse and find alternate routes. This happening on one of the country's oldest and most traveled interstates. Officials telling our Fox 29 affiliate a tanker truck caught fire under I-95 in Northeast Philadelphia near Cotman Avenue causing the northbound overpass to collapse. Now all north and southbound lanes are closed in this area for about three to four miles. Emergency dispatchers were reportedly notified just before 6.30 this morning. Firefighters arriving to the aftermath to assess the damage with portions of the northbound lanes reduced to rubble. The fire was under control around an hour later at 7.30 a.m. On Sunday morning, U.S. Secretary of Transportation Pete Buttigieg saying federal resources are going into action to offer any assistance that U.S. DOT can provide to help with recovery and reconstruction. Local officials are telling people to brace for a long call in getting this interstate fixed. As first responders learn more about the scope of the damage, they're pointing a finger at the initial truck fire for creating this messy situation. It's a lot of heat. Uh, yeah, bent, bent steel. A lot of heat. Probably very, very hot. Um, yeah, don't know. If, uh, we, 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 we did get reports of heavy black smoke. When, when, I, when I got here, it was uh, heavy black smoke and fire, so it was a, a very, very intense heat. Right now, there's no word on any injuries. Officials say the scale of this damage means there could be weeks of repairs and, of course, some hiccups for summer travel plans. In New York, CB Cotton, Fox News.